have to chop up some strawberries. Okay, they are frozen. The reason why they're frozen is because they work a lot better. I use frozen because they work a lot better than the um, than the um, fresh strawberries. Uh, they, it lasts longer. It holds up to the butter and don't get all mushy. Okay, so you just dice them up so you can have nice little chunks, depending on how many strawberries you want to see, you know. Um, I like a lot, okay, so you can use fresh strawberries. This is just my preference to use frozen strawberries. Okay. I had gone to Charlotte, North Carolina uh, one year and we went to a restaurant and they had strawberry butter and I've been making it ever since, okay. Because it's easy and it tastes good. So you just cut it up, chop it up. I'm doing one stick of butter because uh, I'm going to uh, save it for when I need it, you know. Um, nothing special going on but we'll have it ready when there is something special going on mm -hmm. there we go first thing we're going to put in is unsalted butter you can use salted butter if you like okay but that takes away the sweetness you know, but salt and sweet usually go well together anyway. Okay. I use um, some gel, some um, colorful gel, because I want it to be pink. Okay. So you want to make sure that this butter is room temperature. Therefore, it will be nice and soft as it is. We're going to add some sugar. And um, where are my measuring cups? Oh. I'm going to add a cup of sugar to this uh, cup of, uh, well, maybe a little more. Uh, but it's not a big deal, trust me. Okay, so we're going to add a cup of sugar out of my nice um, measuring cups. All right, we're going to mix that together. You want to make sure that the butter and the sugar are mixed well together. And we're going to add some strawberry flavoring. It adds a little strawberry taste, not much. Some pure vanilla. Oops. I'm tired. Okay. And as you can see, it's coming together nicely. We're gonna um, throw in a little coloring. Okay, not too much, because we do not want it red, we want it pink. So just a little bit at a time. As you can see, it will come together. And be pink. Okay. And now we're going to incorporate some strawberries, not too much little at a time. That might be enough. Okay. 
And there you have strawberry butter. So let's taste it and see what we got here. So here's the strawberry butter. Um, it's a nice color. I'm going to taste a little bit. I want a little strawberry. Taste a little bit with a strawberry and see what we got. melts in your mouth <laughs> it's really good okay so we will finish this up and i'll show you how to store it okay so we have our strawberry butter here as you can see okay it's nice and sweet it's not overly roll of a little bit out put it on the counter and we're going to add all this butter to it okay get all the butter all of it is good good to eat Okay. We're going to fold it over and just sort of make it into a bar. Okay. So when you go to use it, you can slice it. We're going to put it in the freezer. So, I'm going to make sure we make it nice, kind of even, okay, just roll it up into a bar, okay. This way, we put it in the freezer. We slice what we want. We're going to be using a lot of this when, you know, we make maybe chicken and waffles or whatever. Uh, so it will be fine. Okay. So there you have it. Strawberry butter. Get you some. Make you some. strawberry butter is delicious. Mm.